Yeah, hey, Bailey, if you don't mind me asking, you can totally not like answer this, but yeah. uh, how, how's it going with uh, Ryan? I don't know. Yeah, well, I'm I'm sorry. It's it's not really my fault that uh, Valentina decided to call you down in the middle of our uh, friend outing that we were having. So I'm just kind of you know. I need you to just stop. No, Grace, great. Um, sorry, I didn't recognize you, Gray. Um, can I, Val? Can I just talk to you for like one second alone? Yeah, that's fine. So no, I wouldn't classify that. But thanks for calling to tell me I'm a liar. I I mean, kind of what it sounded like. Uh, Valentino is a freaking jerk. Why did I ever date him? What? What do you think you're doing in my office? Shh, oh, hey. Shh, shh. I... Is there someone whispering? I. This is no, my fine. office. That, we that share was... this one. What are you talking about? That was, that was my shoe squeaking. Don't worry about it. That was your shoe squeaking? Okay. Yeah. Well, we share this office. <laughs> Unless you want to give the talent chief's office to me and Silver, but I'm sure that Keen would not appreciate that. I mean, Keen will have to deal with it if I, if I do that. That is true. She would have to deal with it. Uh, Actually, I'm looking to perhaps relabel that dispatching room downstairs as like the firefighters' computer room, and then you guys would take over the office that is over there I'm... with all the computers, and then. No, I'm not taking. No, we're gonna share this fucking office. I'm not gonna go into a freaking office building like thing where we don't even get our own private space. If if you want your own office, then I'm taking the battalion chief's office, and there, then the battalion chiefs and the lieutenants and the captains can have that glass mouse box of a fucking office. Mouse box? I don't know. Fish tank? Well, we gotta call it the fish tank now. Yeah, but right now, as of right now, myself and you, at least, are sharing this office unless Keen wants to give up for Battalion Chief's office. Yeah, I also need to get a rug in here, I think. Oh, really? Why is that? I don't know. I just think a rug would be very appropriate. Probably, like, you know, on the other side of the desk here. But who knows? What are you typing? I was just typing up a couple of uh, reports as well as getting all the, you know, monthly um, checks out, and I need to uh, obviously send that over to HR and have that signed off from her. But oh, gotcha. <laughs> yeah, because we got you know you know how um, Civic is getting a bit of a, you know he he got a bit of that pay increase from his promotion. What the fucking hey, hell? Um. So this is yeah. Um. Oh hey Bailey. Were you there the entire time? Yeah. Yeah. So, um, I, uh, I called in here while you were on your phone, and then I sat there, and then I was going to scare you, but then Chief came in and started yelling, and I thought he was yelling at me, but he was yelling at you, and I blew my cover. <laughs> were you there the entire time? How'd you get yeah, here? Yeah, I called in, like, while you were typing. Did you know? Like, it's really cool if you just go through. Yeah, you didn't know Like, nobody there. sees you. Oh, what the fuck? Yeah. She, she was just laying in front of the desk this entire time. <laughs> I... I guess I was just so busy looking at myself, you know, before everything started that I didn't notice. Gotcha. Well, I have a proposition for both of you. Okay. Okay. As you know, I've been uh, recently appointed to assistant to the battalion chief. I've been doing a really good job oh, that, at that job. Okay. That, jo that job title doesn't exist, but okay. It does. Um, okay. Maybe this should be directed you at you. Then, you then Glenn... chocolate or something for us? Well, are you trying to kill me, Chief? What do you mean? I'm allergic to one thing, and that's what you want to pay me in? You're allergic to chocolate? Yeah. Make sure that you're logged into CAD. Thank you. I didn't know that. Mm-hmm. It's a, it's a sad life. My dad was allergic to, and so was my grandpa. So I expect my kids I'm, one I'm day so to be allergic. You know what? You should never have kids. Don't put that upon them. I want kids, you know, don't though. Put that, don't put that, that, that trait upon them. That's just making them suffer. Yeah, it's like it's like it's like it's like it's like you know tasting soap when you eat cilantro. It's terrible. I don't know. Uh, it absolutely is. You know what? Um, I, I mean, white chocolate's I good. I I used to have roommates when I was younger, and they would always laugh at me because you know they would add cilantro into every single fucking dish they make, and uh, you know I hated. Sounds horrible. Yes, so as I was saying, I've only been fired from my job one time, and I've already redecorated my office. So I think it's time for me to move up if either of you need an assistant. Your office? W where is your office? It's downstairs. I added a desk and oh, a lava the lamp. the closet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, it's not a closet because there's no door, but like I could put a door in. That's true. But... 
<laughs> to climb through a window? No. But anyway, so I am really good at my job, and I will be your assistant. You're welcome. <laughs> I don't need an assistant, but thank you. You sure? Somebody, I, you know, I could am. watch your office and make sure nobody snuck Incoming in. Incoming 911. Uh, you know what? You know what? That is only that? because I was so busy oh looking at my... Dispatch? Is that us? Oh, I don't hear anything. Did y'all not hear an incoming 911? Oh, no. I'm having cat issues, apparently. Anyway, we'll work on this. I'll let you talk, but um, I will be uh -huh. your assistant. You're welcome. Soon! Okay. But... Sorry for blowing up your spot. No, because he failed to put his vote in. Guys, well, it's guys. Because I can't, I can't What's guarantee up? anything. Oh. oh. Yes. Guys. No. Hi, Bailey. What's up? Hi. How are you, Bailey? Bailey? What? Is this privacy glass? Can she see no. in? Yes, I can yeah. see it. If we, if we see it, so she's like a dinosaur, should she just go away? Look, this one was mine, <laughs> wow. but then it was best. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. The door. I'm you on your you? desk. Okay, there you go. Ah, no, I don't want to be on this desk. I'm sorry. <laughs> Are we having a party on Captain's desk? I'm, I'm, if no, I were you, I would, whoa, I would go down there now. You're all those papers, bro. What are you doing? Oh, you're going to mess them Captain, all up. Captain, I think, Captain, you see I'll this? I'll rewrite them. I'll rewrite them. Wait, 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 wait a minute. You just stepped you on entering... the Captain's papers? Stop. Stop a minute. You're entering a station with your bunker gear on. Are you actually kidding me? Are you asking me to strip down right now? There's a lady <laughs> in the room. That's up to you. Oh, my I mean, as long as you have boxes on. <sighs> Get out of here. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what I have on. I just wear my bunker gear. What do you mean you don't wear a... what? <laughs> it's because I give a surprise for the medics if I go down. Oh my goodness. Um, okay. just like how I put. If you go eyes, down, so... I'm sending the other medics to you. We're not. It looks like no. It looks. <laughs> it yeah, looks like Squidward. A... I always have googly eyes down there, so it looks like. Squidward. Yeah, Manning, do me a favor. Send right, one of that. Okay. Wait, what's going on? Well, I'll be in my office. You have an office? Yes. Yeah. Oh. We have yeah. offices. No, Can you the don't. Be my office. Um, use the no, but, but the Bailey has no, an actual office. Else. Everybody else. Everybody else. Generally... Is your office down there? Oh, no, it's this way. Just in case he goes down. Yeah, but I like this new uh, remodeled station. It's over here. Oh. But I'm redecorating. Don't worry. <laughs> King gave it to me. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, she gave it to me when she promoted me. So. Um, oh. I'm putting in a desk right here, and then a lava lamp, and it's gonna be great. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I like, um... It's, uh, nice. Thank you. It's definitely nice. Now get out, I'm working. Oh, okay. Is that a pursuit? What? I, if you're saying something, I think I'm deaf to you. I, I don't think it was a pursuit! Oh, I go. think it was just there. one cop don't car! Is that don't better you for you? You don't yell at me! I don't wanna yell at, yell at you! Because you I said the same you. thing! Anyway, how you what doing? You you're gonna make me show my- You're gonna make me show my googly eyes! You get out of here! <laughs> what about you? Are you okay <laughs> today, sir? I'm fine, you. Are you sure? I am. Okay. Well, as a U.S. citizen, I have the right to decline an order. And You're I'm a U.S. citizen? <laughs> Technically, yes. I didn't know this. Well, you know what, actually? Try to get off here if I'm in trouble. Exactly, yeah. I risk, I run the line every day. If I get in trouble, I'm just gonna be pointing right here. Oh, why, why me? Why is it always me? Because you're my scapegoat. I'll I'm say that you made me do it. I'm a Pacific is an amount, it's just hashtag blame the car. Uh, you know, English, goat, time, yeah. same thing if you really compare them. They eat about anything. I just work here. Beans on toast. 
<clears throat> I love beans on toast. Exactly. Point proven. So, do you eat the beans with the skin on or off? How do you take the skin off what? of the can? Well, no, if you take it out of the can, just... you're taking the skin off of it. So, do you eat it's... it with the can on or off? I don't I, know what you're I... saying. I'll be back. <laughs> are you? Are you allowed in this office? I'm doing my job. But this is Battalion Chief's office. Yes, and I'm her assistant, and I'm filing her paperwork because I'm good at my job. Is she actually having you file her paperwork? Yeah. Really? Well, I mean, as long as you don't expect a pay increase. I already got it. What? In what? What do you- Chief, do you want me to be your assistant? No, no. Did she authorize a pay increase without talking to us? I don't know what y'all talk about. I don't think you're supposed to be in here, though, so if you want to get out of the office. This is my station. I can be in any room I want. Okay, I'll take the Bye. other office, then. No, no, no. You can you can stay here and file the paperwork. No, nope, here, I'll get this one. I was just making sure you're all right. Chief! Chief, come here! What? What? See? Okay. <laughs> you don't need to do that. Now I'll make it- I'll get all the dust off for you. How do you like your coffee? I don't drink coffee very often actually, so- Tea? I like jasmine tea. I don't need you to get uh, tea. Jasmine go, tea! Go Coming right up, boss! Else. Go I got it! No, I'm not staying in my office. I'm gonna be That's wondering. fine! I'll find you! Kind of awkward, but yeah, that's very true. Like I ate ten people group shower. You want to go okay, shower together? Next. Okay, boys. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, we're checking. I mean, <laughs> I uh, I can tell you. Who, where Bailey? Yeah. yeah no, y'all enjoy your shower. Here. No. Mm hmm nah, The thing is, hey, M Matt's lonely. So Do we have jasmine tea? And oh, good question. No, we were looking for people. I couldn't find anyone, so we were looking for Ah, Chief's cooking. Uh-huh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. A little steak here. That one looks pretty good. Yeah. I don't know uh, what's up with this pan, though. This pan looks older than I am. Look at all the scratches in it. First of all, who... Like, this is a non-stick pan, and someone used a metal spatula to, like, on this thing and scratched it all up. Oh, oh no. I mean, it's the same logic with... We are in a fully new renovated station, and we have a 1985 TV, so... <laughs> right, yeah. Couldn't afford the flat screen. No, yeah. no, it's, it's, it's a nice box feature, okay? It's just from a retro wow. side. Wow, okay. A you box know. feature, really? Yeah, you know, it's a, it's, it's a from the retro. Come on. But I would appreciate yeah, it. I, was, I literally but... sat there and watched TV last night, and I was squinting my eyes. <laughs> okay, so. it was an Atari. What? We go great with an Atari. Ooh, I I would love that actually. Nintendo sixty four. I think you just got a Snapchat. I did. <laughs> you hear it across the room. Oh yeah. How how are you all, uh, three doing? Solid. How are you? Good. I'm good. I'm making Campbell tea. Oh nice. I thought you just for a second, I thought that was the brand. I'm like, wait, Campbell makes more than soup? They, they no, but I made... <laughs> <laughs> Campbell made us some chicken noodle soup the other day, which... Not Campbell, Young made us Campbell's chicken noodle soup the other day, which was good. <laughs> That's funny. Wait a minute. Young makes Campbell's noodle soup. Yeah, mm -hmm. he does. I see. I mean, that would be a great, like... Pet name for her from him, right? <laughs> Just noodle. <laughs> Call her noodle. <laughs> and what's the soup part? I'm gonna recommend. I'm gonna oh recommend that to, to Young. <laughs> oh God. Mm. Oh, yeah, Bailey. I, if you don't mind me asking, you, you can totally not like answer this. But yeah. uh, how, how's it going with uh, Ryan? I don't know. Oh, I'm Damn. sorry. 
So. No, I mean, uh, I don't know. We had a good first date, and then we're supposed to go on a second date, and then he just kind of, like, went Failed? on vacation from the city for a bit. So I haven't oh, really okay. seen him. Um, I did you, meet this you other... You though, right? I don't know. Like... Because I'm going to have words with that man if he goes. I really don't... I, I, I would... I'm not opposed to a second date, but I'm also not sure if that's going to happen at this point, because, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Basically, I messaged him a few times, and I'm not going to push it anymore. If he wants to, he'll do it. All if right. not... So we definitely have to take a wizard at VPDIC. I don't know. It is. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Just yep. friendly visit him and just politely ask him if he was out of his mind. Okay. Okay, I'll that's... be back. I got to go give this to her. I'm not actually drinking it. Okay. Oh, no, the table. Oh, jeez. Man, no. Here you go. Hey, who's in here? What do you want? Oh, uh, we're gonna go take a ladder to get some gas quickly because it's only it's very Not low. Allowed. Yeah, well. Here you go. Not allowed. What? What, Billy? Oh, you actually got me tea. <laughs> you didn't need. Here you go. Thank. <laughs> Have fun. I appreciate it. Thank you. I think I came up with a new idea of some kind of a regulation. Oh? Um, to not wear banker pants and boots in offices. That's not a bad idea, actually, it's yeah. Especially not the it's second come, floor. It's coming quite popular. So just the, the state, black, it's white. It's coming quite popular, especially. Yeah. If they're at, there are like some states and departments out of state. Um, are They're not even letting turnout gear in the, in the cabs of the fire trucks. Which I think that's a little too extreme, but... You know, um, I, like, yeah. if there's no turnout gear, like, allowed in fire stations anymore. I mean, it's fair because, you know... All the carcinogens and shit carcinogens, like that. chemicals, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and you're spreading I mean, this out into the whole... Drug I mean, take a seat I, and I, breathe in. Yeah, I mean, I actually would be fine if someone has, hey, bunker pants on, I don't know, in the apparatus bay or in the locker room, yeah. but not upstairs. That's what I can Yeah, I mean, but cause, the bunker gear is supposed to stop in the locker room, like, that's as far yeah. as you go. I mean, because Warner was just dancing on Manning's desk, so, yeah. yeah. I mean, you didn't even apologize about the fucking papers, too. Look at the, the disrespect from you people. <laughs> they, they just black the disrespect. Now. Yeah, no, it, it, it's more popular out of state. Um, I think you just yeah. lost your steak, Chief. I... Uh... Oh. No, I, I just ate it, actually. I was very hungry. Oh, you do? Is it had a little bit of counter tasting into it as well? Just a little, that's the new seasoning? Yeah, a little, little, little bit of counter, you know. I think someone's boots have been on this counter, actually. <laughs> I was on the Most table, likely. not the counter. Yeah. I uh, found the table, yeah. Also, I'm realizing there's a giant tea set on that table I should have looked at a second ago. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Probably. Look at that, that's pretty fancy over there, Look too. at that, that's really perfect for making tea versus this fruit basket I used right here. Yeah. Also, I don't know if anyone knows, there's like one apple over here. That is like extra long. Oh, it's like shaped like a extra pineapple. Long. Yeah, look at the one closest to the coffee machine. Oh, ah, oh, that's a long and, apple. And, yeah, I mean, it actually kind of reminds me of some kind of bell paprika, you know? Looks like a soda can. can. Yeah. Like a bell pepper. Yeah. Yeah. Fire command requesting apparatus assignment. Cardboard of the unit. <clears throat> Go ahead and uh, hop on. Yeah. Here, please. By the way, uh, okay. who left there? Um, I see yeah. those fucking everywhere. Uh, I mean, he left. It's just there. a rotten yeah. orange over here. What is this about? <laughs> why, why are we just leaving rotten food around? Yeah. Why are we having a yearly storage off um, thing in here? Yeah, we off, could... off cleaner. Definitely oh, use. Whatever, uh, it's caution. Kills. Uh. <laughs> and, uh, holy shit, man! That um, has a thing called you put on the floors to wipe it and to keep it keep it clean. A bleach, for fuck's sake! Yeah, yeah. So why we keep a yearly soldier bleach in the kitchen? Um, yeah, we are weird. Spices. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why do you put grass cuppings in a bottle? Why are you asking questions? Why are you making no? Drink it! I dare you. you ever been to Jamba it. Juice? Sip. He's gonna spit it out and paint the, the wall green.
Hmm. It might be throw up. <laughs> <laughs> That's like an awful prank right there. I don't know what this is. Who throws up in a bottle and just leaves it there? Is that okay, yours, Bailey? No, I'm not drinking that. Twenty right. bucks. I'll take one for the team. I'll See, do it. Who, who are you to who are you to, to to give me a command to do it? But then you won't follow your own commands. That's that's not Oof. a good leadership right Oof. there. Oof. Oh no, they didn't. He did not. He did I not think, just pull I think that you out. Have to drink oh. it. No, that's disgusting. Who wants to drink it? What is it? I'll take one for the team. I'll do it. Okay. All right, here. Oh wow. Hopefully you don't die because we can, we don't have a. <laughs> you don't have health insurance. Oh, I'm just telling you, you right now. Yeah, we, we, yeah, we give you guys health insurance. You have amazing health insurance. Well, if you I don't try... make it, please. You know the one thing yeah, I'm excited um, about is geez, the, one thing, the one thing I'm not. I'm I'm surprised we don't have tonight is probationary because we could have made a probie do it. Yeah, the thing right. is, he would have done no. it right That's mean. Done right no, we're not gonna. Before you drink it, I can not gonna have someone. Campbell, that's character building. It's okay if you don't make it. We have at least two well-trained medics here. Oh, oh my god. The thing god. is, they want to ride with you, guys. <laughs> so, do you consider yourself oh, a well trained medic? Oh, wait, isn't that my spit oh. cup? Oh, well. well. Uh, oh, boy. <laughs> that was great. That, that might be someone's spit cup, actually. What was it? I doubt it. It no. looks like it's a, it yeah, looks yeah, like it's a like green act. smoothie, you know, with yeah, like I don't it do was chewing tobacco. It's kind of weird smoothie. Definitely like in there for a couple days. Ugh. Ugh. What's next? You're gonna have fun sitting on the phone now. Next? Let's add some ice cubes what? to yeah, it. Worcester, see if Worcester, it there's, not a, there's not a smoothie. Yeah, oh, try that one over go. there. Oh don't don't eat the tennis oh, balls or whatever oh that is. Oh my god, there's another one. Are those tennis uh, balls on the counter? Is he those actually gonna oh. try it? No, they're not. I was going to, but. Quite, quite. What? Sandra's fire, attention, Sandra's fire. Could I have you en route to postal 3045? That's postal 3045. I'm gonna have to run a lap. For shooting victim, be advised. Oh gosh, I gotta run a lap. The chest, Elio, are on scene, uh, scenes code 4. Copy. You can show Rapid 1, Medic 1, Medic 5, and Engine 5, and Car 4 en route to that. Such a long run! 10-4. Correction, medic one. Yeah, I'm fine. I just had a double A meeting not so long ago. Double A meeting. Alcoholics Anonymous. Made no, one video. Could no. you get a repeat on that post, please? Bailey, you should be hearing the disrespect that this man has been saying to the chiefs, line officers. Oh my god. I just called as I see it. What'd you say? Call the chief old because there's someone with white hair outside at the chief's wife then because he's old. I mean, you're jumping to all the conclusions of calling him old. You've called him old more than I've called Me? him old in Me? this day. Me? When, did, when did I call him old? When did the word old come out of my mouth? You've said old about the chief ten times in the past sentence. Seems like, Am you're I just, like you're connecting the dots and hopping to the end. You're jumping to your conclusions. The dis no, you are you are disrespecting the chief. Disrespect. Sounds like someone's trying to brown nose for promotion. <laughs> oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You trying to be in that fire catalog? Trying to be in the calendar? I was gonna think about making one a little bit ago, but I didn't do it. This is why you're <laughs> To him. That's why you're trying to. That's no, why you're trying to work no, on I, so I trying to get that fire it, calendar pushed. I pitched it last year. And and have you know that I'm gonna be October and December on that calendar already. <sighs> I was getting. You guys are the most distracting fucking thing in this world right now. I was so close, <laughs> so yeah. close. What'd you get? <laughs> yeah, what'd you I got like 115, and I was what? Trying to, you guys need to. Mm, I need to play this game when you're not around. <laughs> Wait, what game is it? So <laughs> Oh, gotcha. No, Warner, they- I actually I hate- I am like, so upset at you all that you're all doing five fucking laps. Go. I was like- Ooh, I'm getting that Except for Bailey. Except I'm for Bailey. Nice. I was Woo! I wasn't talking either. Calendar body. 
Uh, Warner, I'm- Campbell, I was in my head, so... You were still talking when I was playing. I'm playing Snake. I was actually playing Snake the entire time, so... Oh my gosh, don't turn into I, deputies, guys! That's all they I do! I my boyfriend, but I really wanted to be this chief, so... And you guys ruined it what, for what me. What did he- what, what does Face have? Uh, like 135 or something. Jesus Christ! Chief, they ruined my highest score on Snake! What? You should punish them. How? By being loud and annoying right next to me when I was silently here. <laughs> no, I mean, how do you want me to punish them? No, she already punished them. They're gone. Oh, I've, yeah, I already have them on five laps. Uh, Manning, get your ass going. I didn't say anything. I kept my mouth shut. Oh. You know what would have okay. fixed this, Campbell? <laughs> what? If you had an assistant to tell him to not stand next to you and talk. Just throwing that out there. Oh my goodness. I literally was trying to yell at you guys to go away, but I guess when I play Snake, I can't talk. I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm so focused in the game. In the game, yeah. Maybe, maybe you do need a assistant to the deputy chief. <laughs> no. What about assistant to chief? I'm so upset. I got 114. That was so close. I think I, can, it, um, I can beat. Sounds better. I think I can beat Phase. You know, you know what we need to do? We need to have like a competition with who can have the highest like Snake score in this in this uh community. Do they keep your scores? Like, can you see phases score no, and everything? Not. No, you just want to take a, probably, you know, you use your just take a picture, take a yeah. Screen, yeah, screenshot. Okay, I'm gonna put that on Twitter right now. But you're gonna get all the state guys to do it too while they're running radar. Oh, apparently it's a comedy <gasps> show tonight. I'm so upset. My life's over. I'm not gonna beat my high score. Uh, it took forever to get over there. What's your Twitter handle? Uh, I don't have one. I don't. Oh my god, you are just. Like, man, the shut chief up, old man. Yeah, the chief even has one. Yeah, I'm an old man and I have a Twitter account. What's your excuse? I don't like Twitter. Young lady. What do you mean you I don't, don't like, like Twitter? It's annoying. You're annoying. Your face is annoying. No, you. No, you. I was going to tag you, but never mind. I'll just do it a different. Ah, <sighs> sure it was a quiet night. God damn it. What do you mean, god damn it? I haven't every, gone anywhere every, today. I haven't gone time... anywhere today. Every time you say that... I have not gone anywhere today, okay? okay every Twitter. time you say that and then you, and then you get off shift, stuff starts popping off. Every Good. time. Good. Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> right? Chief, did you tweet, by the way? I just, I, I just did, yes. Look, look for the look for the sad chief in a uh, curled up in a bowl crying. Oh, like, now I found it. Thing. Now it's so cute. <laughs> uh, that's a good profile picture. Whoever Thank made that's really good. So shout out to them. No, I'm in my forties. Really, I thought you were younger than that. <laughs> I am. That's like another twenty years away. Well, less than that. Really. Less than that, actually. My profile's not as cute as yours, though. I need to up my sad game. <laughs> that's also that's also me with the old uniforms we used to have. Aww. And when I had longer hair, which I just realized is my picture upstairs. Oh, is that? That's fine. I want to keep that picture. Woo, fifty. Hey, Val, what's up? Hey, um, you'd wanted to like talk the other day, and I kind of figured I'd give you a call and see if you wanted to meet somewhere. Uh, we can. I am on duty right now, but I can meet you oh. wherever. Um, are you on the medic? Like, you're not, you're able to roam? Yeah, yeah, I'm on rapid. I can go wherever. Oh, well, we're at, uh, where are you guys stationed out of? Oh, at station one. Uh, which one's that again? Uh, the one, like, in the middle of the city on Rockford Drive. But, uh, where you guys at? Oh, yeah. Uh, we're at this, like, thing in Mirror Park. Okay, yeah, 7 yeah. Two, or 7323? Uh, you said 7323? Yeah, it's like this comedy thing. I'm not sure what's going on here. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. I can meet you there. Alright. Uh, Bye. just give me a few minutes. Right? Bye. Alright. I'm 
I'm gonna walk away. <laughs> just wallow in it. Wallow in it. Um, pass, go pass. away! Try to no, no. Stay. I, I have something oh. important. I yes, put put the snake down. Okay, so Valentino just called me and said he wanted to talk and to meet him at the club. Really? Okay, hold on. Yeah, and I do I go? Do I stay here? Like right now? Yeah. Here, make sure you also talk a little. Why did he talk to you? I don't know. He just said he wanted to talk. Um, that's up to you if you feel like you want to talk with him. Are you two friends? No, not really. We haven't really talked much. Do you want to be friends with him? I don't know. Um, that's up to you, honestly. I if, I mean, if you feel like you don't hold resentment, then it might be a good idea just to clear the air on something. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. Um, is that what you're gonna do right now, though? Yeah, probably. Where does he want to meet you at? At the comedy club thing that's happening right now, Mayor Park. Is it comedy club right now? Yeah. You should just go to go be at the comedy club in case I need, like, to, you know, emergency escape because of a call. I have been stuck here, and I've been so bored that I've been playing a... Oh, I forgot. You can't game, leave. You're so... on, um, ladder yeah, or whatever. Yep, yep. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. Okay. Um, I mean, I can... Are you going to go off duty? No, I mean, I don't think oh, okay. so. I don't know if it's gonna be a long talk. I mean, if that, but. Right, yeah. Um, fuck, I wish I could go with you. Okay, no worries. I forgot you were on ladder or engine or whatever. I will I'm let you ladder, know yeah. how it goes. But... Uh, yeah, let me know. Just text me and, um, good luck. Okay, thank you. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Jeez. I've been yawning a lot today, I don't know why. Rapid yeah, one to fire radio. Coffee, that's why. Fire radio's out of channel. Okay. Show rapid one roaming. There we go. Hey, sorry about the wait. Hey, what's up? So, uh, you were talking to me the other day, and we kind of got a call, so I figured I'd see, like, what was up. Um, okay. I mean, like, you, we, like, you asked a question, I don't remember what you asked. I just got the special panic button, gotcha. so I was going to see if you wanted to talk. Um, I mean, I've kind of figured it out from now, from the time I asked you, but, um, I actually was asking Montana. I didn't realize you were in the car. Oh. Well, I mean, to answer your question, I guess, yeah, I guess you figured it out. I mean, I mean okay, that's good. I'm glad. I'm not, I'm going to be real honest. I'm not going to say anything with both of you here, so. What do you mean by that? I just, nothing. I mean, it's, there's definitely something. Kind of regular being channel. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy for you, Montana. I mean, I don't. I just send red fire. I don't know if you're mad at me or, vehicle accident. or like and zero. I, I really don't know, but North Shallon Avenue. I mean, I told you motor vehicle accident. it's nothing personal. Six zero four two North Shallon Avenue. I mean, are you Flip are you over. seeing anyone now? Driver of the vehicle is outside of the vehicle right now. Uh, sorry, just injured. one second. Radio uh, is blaring. Possibly leaking oil. Car two to medic, please start heading around engine two, ladder, or sorry, engine five and ladder one will be in route as well. Okay, I'm good now. Sorry. Anyway, are you are you seeing anyone now? Um, no, not really. Look, what did you? Are you? What do you? What? What? I, I, what did you, do you want to talk about? Like, I like I said, I thought you wanted to have a conversation today. I didn't know you didn't know I was in the car. I didn't know you thought Montana was alone. I mean, I, I would love to have a conversation Probably, with yeah. you at some point, but I'm also not going to say anything in front of this random guy back there and then Montana. Random yeah, guy. this random that's, guy. That's, that's great. Gray. Well, I don't know. Great. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm sorry. It's, it's not really my fault that uh, Valentina decided to call you down in the middle of our uh, friend outing that we were having. So I'm just kind of, you know. I need you to just stop. 
No, Gray's great. Um, so I didn't recognize you, Gray. Um, can I, Val, can I just talk to you for like one second alone? Yeah, that's fine. Sorry. Also, it's good to see you, Montana. Good to see you as well. How is it back there? What do you mean? Okay. Look, I'm sorry. I'm not trying to be mean or rude or anything. No, I, I understand. I just, I like I said, I thought you wanted to talk to us because I mean, you were talking to Montana, and then we kind of left and. I yeah, I know. I know. There was a lot of shooting oh, went down and everything. Um, I mean, in from the east I, I, side of I still think you're a great guy, and I am happy for you in Montana. I'm not gonna lie and say I'm not pissed that you know you didn't have time, but now you clearly have time for a girl. So there was a reason. Well, I mean. You I still like you. You gotta understand. Look what I look, like. I'm literally off duty, but I still have a fucking cop car. It's that okay. Type I, of, I really don't care. I mean, why? Why don't I don't understand? What? I I don't know what you want from me. Like, like I, I I don't want anything. I just want you to not be mad at me. I want you to understand that it wasn't personal. No, I know it's not personal. You had feelings for her and wanted to be with her, and that wasn't I get why, that. Though. So then, what was it? You're a firefighter. I'm a police officer. I can't carry you around in a cop car and bring you to scenes. Okay, cool. So I'm not I, tough enough know, for you. Okay. It's not that you're not tough enough. I legally can't do that. I can't put you no. at risk bringing you on active shooter scenes. I mean, it's a little bit different when, you know, she's a sworn in police officer. And it yes, wasn't I get it. She's great for you. That before. Okay, whatever. I didn't even have feelings for her before you and I did, like broke up. She had literally been new to the department. It was after the fact. I mean, I've told you this. I, I, I don't have time to date any anyone that's not doing what I do. Great. I, I mean, even Great. if you're just not even a cop. Like, I, like if you're just some random girl walking down the street with no fucking job. I don't have time for that. Okay, no, I get it. It's fine. Because I can't, there's, there's you know, no I can't do my job. I, that's great for you. That's a choice you've made. You can do your job with somebody else. But I just, I don't know why we're judging this back up. Well, I like I said, I, I, know, there's, I, I know there's been tension. Like, I know... We I haven't could hear it in your talked when you asked that question. Yeah, because you literally showed up at my apartment one day, said you don't have time for it, and then we literally never talked again. That wasn't my choice, though. What do you? No, it was. It's it's fine. It's it you choose what to spend talk. your time with. It wasn't mine either. I don't. I don't. I don't think you're understanding when I'm when I'm in this car. I'm responsible for anything that oh happens. Oh my god, I fully understand you. You're a big bad cop who no, thinks you can do everything. Cop. Yeah, you are. I have a and team you're of responsible. Plus people that exactly. I have to be responsible yeah. For. And if I don't show up to be responsible for them and one of them gets killed, it's going to be my fucking fault. Okay. Cool. We done? I don't I don't I mean, I guess. Okay. I thought we were going to have a conversation. I didn't think you were this mad about it. What I'm Look, I honestly wasn't mad until we started having this conversation. Well, I... I, I don't know what to say. It's whatever. Yeah, I mean, no, you made a choice. You are a cop and you're literally nothing else. So that's fine. There's nothing that's, wrong with that. I mean... Does your job not consume you? Does your job not make who you are? Like, I don't... I mean, it defines you, but there's other stuff too, and it's it's just a choice. You can choose where to spend your time and what you want to do with your time. And you're clearly I, off duty right now. Yes, you can. You're off duty right you now can take with your uniform your off and not be legally obliged to help people. I can't. What do you I mean? You oath. literally. Oh my gosh. You think you're okay? That's fine. I. I. You think when I take this uniform off that I don't help people when I see them no, hurt? I think you do, but you don't have to. You don't have to be a cop either, but we both I do. do. But no, you 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 don't get that. I don't have to be a, I don't have to be a cop, sure, but yeah, and this I was a career that I chose before yeah. this was even a thing. I got gotcha. you. No, I get it. In your mind, you think it's very different between the two of us, and that's fine. I'm gonna we're gonna disagree on that. So, so I mean, I'm just trying to help you understand. Like when you're off duty, do you carry a radio around, and are you required to respond to shit that comes over the radio? You're not required I, to do that. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Bailey, I had. You want to go look what's in the back of that car? I have everything necessary I in the back of that car. I don't know how I can make this more clear. I don't care. 
Right, but I am required. You, you're telling me yes, I'm not required. Yes, you're I'm choosing you that to do that. I'm not going to give up my career for a relationship. I'm not asking you to. I have no feelings for you. You could easily I... have relationships with somebody else who wasn't also a cop. You want to be with her. Just be with her. Just stop lying to yourself. It's fine. I'm not lying to myself, and I'm not lying to you. You are, though, so it's okay. Okay. Enjoy your time. Yeah. Two thirty power. Go for. Be advised, we have an MVA at three zero three seven. I don't know if y'all were ever dispatched to it. We have a blue four door small car that is smoking at this time. Ten four. We'll head in route. Hey, from do you also have an ETA? Also. Part two. We're currently in a bit of a traffic jam, but once we're once we leave here, we'll have about a two to three minute ETA. Ten four. Thank you. Two thirty. Ten one. Back to Canada. I'm obtaining refusal and then I'll route to that NBA. 10 4, thank you. Car 2, uh, do we have any units at station? Rapid one is currently en route to that NBA. 10 4, thank you. one is 23 on C. No, you can just call over the radio and just tell them to have a metro unit with it. Let them know one of us will be down there soon. Just get a right. location for me, please. Thank, Thank you. At this uh -huh. point because this is yes. ridiculous. Hey, <laughs> hey, talk with them. I don't know. I think uh, I think the male on the yellow is the one that needs the medical. Gotcha. And everyone's out of the car and everything. Just a minor. Yep. Perfect. Thank you. Why is it every time I come in the car? Nah, bro. It happened on like whatever this road's name is called, like the main one out here, like a big old rock of like heaven and Christ. Hey, side so interrupt. Did he get hurt at all? Is he okay? Uh, yeah. Yeah, he was a sultan. Yeah, dude, punched they just like times. punched me in the face, bro. It was just like not negative. It was just like not positive waves. And it was just. Yeah, if you can just give him a look over. Like, yeah, hey. absolutely. Uh, just give me one sec. I'll let you keep talking with them. Uh, Rapid one to command. Is it odd that I can't Go smell for? something? Like, be advised, it's going to be a minor fender bender, and one shit, one's going to be punched in the face here. 10-4, we'll roll down to a code 2, still heading route. 10-4. Alright, sorry about that. And you said you can't smell. Medic 5, would you so like yeah, to smell? Yeah, like, I, well, I, I can't smell, bro. It's just like... Oh, yeah, that's that's definitely going to be out of place there. Oh, no. Hey, no, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you a bandage here. Just hold pressure on that nose, get that bleeding stopped. Greasy. Alright, don't worry, it's not too bad. We'll be able to have the doctors get that right back into place for you. Right. I don't want to go to the doctors, though. Like, what do you mean, though? We gotta definitely get you to the hospital. So just, just like, punch me in the face again. Then, you know, just do it on the opposite side. We'll put the nose back in place, and you know, we're good to go. I mean, that's that's one way to do it, but that's not going to be effective. What if I break it even more? Oh, fucking send it, you know? I no, I'm not, I'm not gonna do that, but, um, we'll just clean off this the rest no, of no, blood. It, it's okay, it's okay, do it, do it, do it. Good, alright. Uh, alright. Perfect, okay. 
And then um, what I am going to do is I'm going to give you an ice pack. You don't have to hold that bandage. I misspoke on that. But if you will hold this ice pack to your head here, it will help with the bruising. How many times did you get punched? Uh, I don't know. Uh, four? Five? Uh, the guy just punched me a bunch in the face. No, I just like enough to break my nose. So I don't gotcha. Know. Okay. I mean, there's and not then, much else. Can you oh. believe it? The guy, the guy tried to run me over with a car. Yeah, you know, he's just spreading so many negative waves. Jeez, okay. All right, well, as soon as medics get here, we'll get you to the hospital. Well, I'll let the officer I don't keep go talking. To the hospital, though. Well, your nose is broken. I really well, want to. Besides, it look, the hospital's like right over there. It's maybe a one minute trip to Sandy. It's super quick. Uh, but then they're going to like charge me for the, the ambulance ride, and I don't have any fancy. money right now. I mean, we can work but... all of that out later. It's all just government yeah. Journey, isn't it? I mean, because if you don't fix your nose here, then you know it could cause more damage later in life. That'll cost you a lot more money. I just get one of the boys to just like punch it back in place, you know? I mean, if you absolutely want to do that, you can, but I would highly suggest against that. I asked this dude walking over here if he can like punch it back in place. Okay. Maybe he can do it. Hey. Uh, this gentleman here. I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name. What was your name? You hey, me? Yeah. Uh, my name's Brad. Uh, Brad here got punched in the face about four times. He does have a broken uh, nose. I put some bandage on and cleaned it up. If you want to take a look, though. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So, like, question. Is far too involved. The, like, nice blonde lady says that I have to go to the hospital or something like that. And I only want to go to the hospital. So like, could you just like punch my face again, knock that nose back into place, and then no, sir. I'm just like good to go. So we gotta take you to the hospital because it's just in our policy for the broken bones. It's not something we can completely treat in the field. It has to be looked at by a doctor. You have what to have X-rays done. So I can I can splint broken bones. I can make it so that the injury doesn't get any worse but you still need to be evaluated by a doctor. That's why we have to take you. Ah, oh, not the doctors, dude. Slightly cracked, so we'll have it towed to the nearest uh, shop and you can handle that later. Should you get baseline vitals? Where's that nice lady in the truck? Yes, he yeah, he he's stable, everything is good. Uh, you, that's up to you too, I'm just letting you know. All right, Mr. McFarland, before they do transport you, I just have a couple things for you. All right, here you go. This yeah, is my business so. card. It has my name and rank and badge number on it, uh, as well as my personal things. cell and email. Back over this, and also that red truck, Saul. Hey, boss. Boss. Huh? Can I talk to you later when we're not on a scene? Um... Are you still on scene? You know what? Why don't we talk back at the uh, That's station? what I say when we're not on scene. I'm That's what I say. Yeah, I'm yeah. gonna go off duty once I get there, but I'll wait for you and we can chat. Perfect. I'll get off duty when I get there, too. Oh, okay. Okay. Are you driving? I meant the car's moved now since he tried to, like, yeah, hit it relax. again after... It rolled yeah, over. Well, sir, um, well, depending on other charges, yes, but for what exactly happened here, that is going to be for an entirely different time to discuss. But for the hit and run, as well as the fleeing and eluding from Elio, yes. Yeah, I get it, nice. Nice. let's go. But all right, medics, I have nothing else for him. Feel free to transport him. I already have his number. If I need to contact him, I can do so at a later time. Cool. All right, you ready, sir? Bye, bro. No, I'm not ready. All right, here's All right cool. Then sign Stay the safe. form. You want to get it set up? Huh? Are you ready to go? Okay. Are you going to go? Are you injured? It's not even that far of a transport. You got a broken nose. I can but drag you down like the street. It's still going to be expensive no. as hell. Okay. I, mean, I, I don't want to. I don't want to pay the bills. You know. Sorry, everything for. Yeah, we get that. Units. But two that's something we can work out with insurance, and they can help cover it and everything. It trust me, it'll be much it's better for your health down. in the long run. From what I've heard, the accident wasn't your fault, so I bet you your insurance is gonna. All right. Definitely help you out on this one. All right, I'll hey. get CCTV from the telephone. Okay. I don't want to be insurance, dude. Okay. Hey, sir, can you hear me right here? Can I, I'm just gonna ask a question oh, yeah. real quick. Up, yeah, you're doing. Do you have doing. your uh, insurance or information? This, in whatever this was. <laughs> uh, no, I didn't. You know. Yeah, I need permission to grab it. 
literally I didn't, I, know, I didn't, I don't know. Hey, uh, I was on scene. What's up? So, let me ask you a question. Yeah. And, like, be 100% honest with me. Sure. You told me that you weren't seeing anyone. Yeah. Well, I mean, talking to someone... I don't okay. know if it, I don't know, I mean, I, I don't know how many females are in the fire department. I think, what, you, Campbell, and who else? If you're implying that I lied to you, I went on one date with Gray. I also, not Gray, sorry. I went on a date with a guy named Grayson, and I went on a date with a guy named Ryan who happens to be a firefighter, and then I haven't talked to Ryan in over three weeks. So, no, I wouldn't classify that. But thanks for calling to tell me I'm a liar. I, I mean, kind of what it sounded like. Really? Wow. Okay. Yes. So to answer your question, I went on one date with Ryan a couple weeks ago. And, I mean, I'm not opposed to second date, but I wouldn't classify that as seeing somebody. I mean, unless okay. you would, what's your definition? I don't know. Well, I mean, uh, I, I don't even, I don't think I'd classify that as a seeing someone either, but... I mean, it kind of seems like you moved on quicker than I did. Are you kidding me right now? You realize that- So, what- it, why? Why are you calling? What did- did I do something to you? Like, you've got a no, happy I girlfriend. Just, I, when you I, approach I me with get, two people- you seem, you seem like it's a- like, you're- you're- you're mad about it, and you- you think that I just- I dumped you and then moved on the next day. No, I don't and think that's, that's it. that's not what happened. I don't think that's it at all, and that's not what I'm accusing you of. But you think that I had feelings before before I left you, and that wasn't the case either. Her okay. and I didn't even go out until, I don't fucking know, it- We hadn't even gone out when you asked her that question. That whole question is kind of what sparked the, you know, maybe. There were rumors, multiple people were telling me that y'all were dating and it was going up. And so don't get well, that, well, that question sparked it. I don't know who told it. you that. Listen, it, I am generally did. happy for the two of you. Like, I honestly am. I also generally think you're a jerk. So... Really? Yeah. Are you kidding me? No. Like... <sighs> you think that I'm a jerk? Yeah. You think I'm just some cocky dickbag, don't you? I think you think that you're better than me because you're a cop. I, I And you don't. really like me when I am the damsel in distress that needs to be saved, but... N no. It has nothing to do with that at all. It had nothing to... It, if I really... Okay, if that was really the case, do you think that I would have been like, you know, maybe I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave her and move on? If I really liked you being the damsel in distress, maybe we would have stayed together, don't you think? Wow, okay, cool. So that's what you well, do think just, of me. I'm, yeah. No, I... That, are Listen, you kidding me? You're... I just put your point down. You literally just proved it. It's fine, though. Tell me how I proved it. Tell me. Tell me how I, I proved why? your point. Why? Why do we have to keep talking? Because I don't want this to be this way. I thought I would genuinely I mean, like to be friends with you. That's what I. But you just told me I'm a jerk. So how is that gonna work? Because in your mind, you are a cop twenty four seven, and I. Why would I? I don't know. Why I, can't I don't. Help that. Okay. Cool. I. That's great for it's you. Just, it's. It's. I'm. I'm sorry. I. I'm not asking you to change who you are, so don't do that. Okay. Hello? 
Bailey? Hey, what's up? Hey, where are you? I am done with meeting with these folks. Uh, I'm in the briefing room upstairs, but I can meet you wherever. Oh. Uh, briefing... Oh. Briefing room, yeah, I'll be there in just a, a second then. Okay, cool. I'll see you soon. There you are. Sorry hey. about that. We just got a pretty big donation for the fire department. Oh, you're good. First off, I'm so sorry. I didn't even think I was running into your office. I thought I was running into the hallway. So I felt oh, no so worries. bad when I went in. I was like, nope. <laughs> no, it's okay. Um, on top of that, uh, Valentino is a freaking jerk. Why did I ever date what? him? What did he do? Okay, so he calls and says, like, can we talk, right? And I show up there, and he's with Montana and Gray. So, like, oh. I don't want to be a bitch. I'm not going to say anything in Montana. Like, I, you know, in front of her, I want her to be happy, and I am genuinely, like, glad that they're together. Wait, wait, wait. He has a new girlfriend? Yeah, he's seen Montana. Which, I mean, let's be real. What? We all knew that was going to happen. Uh. But, yeah, so he wants to talk to me in front of his girlfriend. I'm like, what am I going to say? I'm not going to say anything rude to her. Like... You know, I don't know her. She's probably a sweet girl. So anyway, we awkwardly sit there for like three minutes. And then I'm like, hey, can I talk to you alone, Valentino? And he's like, sure. And so um, we go to the side. And I don't know. Like, I don't even know why this was all brought back up again. But it essentially ended with us yelling at each other. Jeez. About and what, he though? had the audacity to tell me how he is a police officer and his job is 24 7 and when i sign off duty i can turn it off but he can't do that and he can't keep track of somebody i don't know basically i'm just a damsel in a distress to him and he couldn't possibly date someone who's not also an officer uh, he's a fucking idiot our job is probably more 24 7 than his is no he literally kept pointing to his car and he's like you see that police vehicle over there that's mine i talk on the radio i do this and i was like okay i get it you're a big bad cop like you made a choice you can choose where to spend your time you're choosing to spend time and that's fine like i don't care and then he kept insisting that he about like his job and how great he was and how he had a thing and if something goes wrong he loses lives and i don't even know why he was bringing this all up i maybe he thought that I, I don't know, it seemed like you two had finally moved on from it and suddenly he comes back to try to take some jabs at you from the sounds of it. Uh, it gets better. So, um, while we're talking there, before we pull it off the side with Montana, um, he says, so are you seeing anybody right now? And I go, no, not really. Um, because I did go on that date with Ryan, but that was three weeks ago and I haven't seen him since. And then I also went on a date with this other guy named Grayson, but that was just like a one-time thing. And so... Um, when we're awkwardly standing, they're like, no, not really. He calls me after, uh, we were on that call with the guy with the broken nose as I was leaving. And he says, essentially accuses me of lying on the phone. And he's like, I've been talking to other officers and I don't know how many female firefighters there are, but I heard somebody's dating a cop. Like he called he's... me to tell, call me a liar. To call you a liar that you were. He, Cause I said, he's like, are you seeing anybody? And I said, not really. Um, um, if that's if that's what your answer is, I don't know why the hell he's getting in your business. In the well, first I place. explained it to him. I was like, I mean, I did go on a date with Ryan, and I would like to go on a second date, but I haven't seen him in like three weeks. So that's not. I would. You wouldn't. Is that dating somebody? I don't think it is, right? Uh, uh not in terms of activating. No, it, it seems like you're just you know going around potentially looking for a possible, you know, person to share your life with. I I don't, I don't know. It's a and then date, I don't see it as a, a dating as an active date. Yeah, so then on the phone, he told me that I moved on before him, and I can't be mad. And I was like, I'm not mad that he's dating Montana. Plus, he said, I'm the reason they got together. What? Yeah. What a fucking jackass.
I, I don't know. Like, it, the thing that got me is in his mind, he really believes that, like, I honestly, he thinks cops are 10 times better than firefighters. You think what? Her that he thinks cops are, like, 10 times better than firefighters. Like, just the way he kept talking and telling me about how his job and how he couldn't date anyone who's not doing I don't... I was, like... He kept explaining that to me, and I kept telling him I didn't care, and I just... Why is this my problem? It... And I don't want to be a jerk. I really don't want to be mean. Like, I want to be friends with him, but he hasn't talked to me, and... He literally showed up at my apartment one day and said, I don't have time to date because I'm focused on my job. And then never talk to me again i'm sorry i'm just venting to you look it's it's gonna be okay in my opinion from the sounds of it you just need to drop contact with him and i'll talk to him if he believes that police officers or whatever ellie are better than fire that's his fucking problem because I mean, that's not am i taking not... that the wrong way i just don't know how else to take like him saying his job is all the time and he can't, doesn't have time like well if it's if it's, if he doesn't have enough time to date you it, that's gonna be the same case for, with montana obviously they they might be able to work together but i'm gonna tell you now relationships do not form very well when you're just working together so that's that's on them yeah also she's me, her subordinate he's her boss like that would be me dating you that'd be you can't do that well, that's whatever department policy they have, and maybe different. We don't allow no, that No, it's here, not. Obviously. I'm not talking about policy. I don't care about policy. Just but, in general, uh, like she teaches, ethically, he teaches yeah, her. It's, yeah, I would say it. It's probably not the right thing, but again, that's that's up to them. That's their business. But it sounds like to me, you need to just well, maybe cut contact with him. Fuck him, you know. Uh, just delete his I number. I thought I had, and then he. <laughs> But here's the thing, I don't, I wouldn't mind being friends with him. I mean, I clearly have no feelings for him anymore. But I also don't want him just going around to everybody in, you know, BCSO and telling them how much, like, of a jerk I am and whatnot. Well, that's on him. People, in my opinion, if anyone bases their judgment on someone based off of somebody else's word and not their own, that's their, that's their problem, Bailey. I personally do not judge people until I, I personally meet them. Okay, I'm but sorry. I, I'm... Worry, I, yeah, I wouldn't worry about, um, you know, your reputation in the sheriff's department or whatever. That it, it's 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 their problem. In the end, we're just doing our jobs. If if he thinks Ellie or better than Fire, well, I'm he's been shot quite a few fucking times and we've saved his life quite a few fucking times. He can take it as that's he the thing wants too is that. I've saved his life too. But he honestly said in this conversation too, he was like, I don't have time to make sure you're safe all the time. Uh, that, what? Yeah. He's not your knight in shining armor. We can keep ourselves safe. It's, yeah, no, that's, I agree, but. Uh, I, I don't know. I would just say stop talking. And when it comes to, you know, if he ever does get shot, which he will, I'm sure, at some point, and you have to work on him, just work on him as a patient, not as a. A oh. friend or, or anybody else. Yeah, a hundred percent. If he gets hurt, I will treat him like anyone else. Open a hundred ten percent effort. I just uh, I don't I don't know anymore. I'm sorry, I Why did I he... uh... Who calls somebody and to have a conversation and brings their new girlfriend with it to their ex to just show up at a at a like comedy event and be like, hey, it was such an awkward, like, I didn't, and now Montana and Gray probably just think I'm a horrible person, so I don't. Well, you know what, fuck them. If they think but... that, then that's their, that's their judgment. You shouldn't worry about what other people are thinking of you. You should focus on being a better Bailey, and you already are amazing, so it's hard to know how much better you can get with that. Okay, thanks. Uh, we can I just don't... work on ourselves. Yeah. There's always going to be people going to be people out there that are just going to hate you because it's you and not for any other reason. That's just something that you have to uh, cope with. So, but in, if you want my honest opinion, I think in terms of how someone treats you right, you know, it seems like you know Ryan did pretty well on that date of of, of his with you and. I'm sure there's other men out there that if you ever do go on a date with and check them out, they'll. They'll probably be a better person than Valentino. Yeah. I guess. I just... 
I don't I don't like being mean to people and I feel like I'm being mean to Val by yelling at him but I also just want to get my feelings out and I don't of course well I'm here I'm here for that appreciate it Thanks. Thanks, boss. Of course. Um, I just would go full no contact with him, though. You know, focus on yourself. Yeah. You deserve better. Yeah, Way I think better. someone's very loudly hitting our bell downstairs. Shit. Okay, why don't we go down there? Okay. I mean, I'm not on duty, but I'll follow. <laughs> Thank you for listening. Of course. Are you coming down? I'm out here, Campbell. Oh, what the hell? I'm out oh, here. You, just, you, you became like a magician. Oh, okay. I was like, you followed me out and then asked if I was coming. Yeah. So I ran through this door and then I meant to run through the glass door and somehow ran into your office and that's how I barged in. <laughs> No worries, no worries. Let's go see who's up at the front. Hello there. Hi, hey, I need to access CCTV footage uh, for that scene that happened earlier on today with the black cavalcade. Right, okay, you want to come with me to my office and I can go grab that file. Do you have a thumb drive I can put it in? Oh, hey, yeah, I'll see you later, boss. Okay. Alright, have a good day, Bailey. Text me later. Okay. Yeah, I have one. I just need to grab some more evidence. 